What's up, Elite Fenix athletes? It's Chris Heria. Welcome to another video of Official Fenix. Today, I'm gonna show you how to get a bigger chest without weights. All right, so let's get started. So today, I'm gonna show you guys how to get a bigger chest without weights. So if you're not using weights, you're most likely doing some form of calisthenics training. And there's only so many progressions that you can go through, so many repetitions that you can hit until you're eventually just doing the same thing over and over again. Your body is gonna get used to these reps, your body's gonna get used to these workouts. You're eventually gonna find yourself slowing down or maybe even plateauing. So a big game changer to introduce into your workout regimen are resistance bands. Resistance bands are gonna bring an aspect of assistance and resistance into your workout regimen. There are huge benefits to using assistance and resistance in your training. Now, resistance, of course, is gonna add more external force in your exercises. Similar to weights, except that weights is a constant equal resistance through full range of motion. Now, with the resistance band, it increases its resistance as the band expands, making it more difficult the closer you get to the end portion of your rep. The closer you get to the top, of your exercise, the more force you're gonna need to apply. Now, the second benefit to the resistance band is the ability to use it for assistance. When you're using assistance training, you're gonna be able to perform harder exercises that you couldn't do without that extra assistance. At first, it may challenge you to do more harder progressions or more harder exercises with assistance, but you still will be able to put in a couple reps in there, even if it's three or four, because eventually you'll master those three or four and then those will turn into multiple repetitions. Eventually you'll master that exercise or progression with that assistance and you'll be able to do a lot more repetitions. At that point, that's when you'll be able to reduce the amount of assistance that you're using use less of the band and more of your own strength. Now your repetitions are gonna greatly decrease at this point, but at least you're doing more weight, you're doing more of your own body weight, harder of a progression than you were doing before. And that's the whole point. Eventually you're gonna be doing it on your own. You use less and less and less assistance. The more you master it with a certain amount of assistance, you lighten that assistance, lighten it until you're basically doing it without it. Now, a lot of these moves that you guys think are impossible, the one arm pull-ups, full planche, a lot of these advanced movements are achieved through assistance training. The only way you're gonna be able to get to these hard moves that are like impossible to do when you first start is by doing it with some assistance. So basically, a great way to get your training to the next level without weights is using resistance and assistance training with a resistance band. And you can pick up your resistance band on thenx.com slash shop. Now I'm gonna show you guys a chest workout where we use assistance training and resistance training applied into these exercises. This workout should take your training to the next level. And the first exercise is gonna be dips. From there, we're gonna move on to push-ups, and then we're gonna go into resistance band flies. Then we're gonna move on to the assistance part of the training, and we're gonna go for much more harder progressions that maybe are more difficult to do on your own, such as the lean planche push-ups, impossible dips, and then one arm straight bar dips. So if you guys are ready, I'm ready, let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so we're going to start off with dips. So to add resistance onto your dips, you can just put the band, twist it like this so it stays as a line, put the band over your neck, and from here, you apply it down onto the dip bar, and you use it for resistance in a dip. Now to put assistance on it would be stepping on it, and this would help you loosen the load of how much your body weight ways. It's going to help you increase your repetitions, be able to add more reps into your workouts. But we're not doing that. We're doing resistance. So you want to put this up on your neck. Come right here. We're going to go full range of motion. Start at the top, all the way locked out. Now, as you can see from here, you feel the majority of your weight, of the majority of the tension of the force in the band is right here, right? Normally the opposite of when you rep. Normally right here is the most intensity. Here, it's less intense on the band. The higher you go on, it gets heavier, 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 and harder. Let's go ahead and rep these out. After using the resistance, 
go on and just rep it out. All right, just a couple dips to show as an example. Let's move on to the next exercise. We have push-ups. So push-ups work the same way. Put them around like this. Instead of putting it on your neck, kind of put a, a little further back right here, right on top of the triceps by the shoulder blades. Now, each resistance band that you get is gonna have its own amount of weighted resistance. The thicker it is, the more of a weighted resistance it's gonna be, or the more weight of assistance it will be. So you wanna make sure to get a couple so that you can be able to train in different weights. So for example, if I was to use a lighter one of these, this would be a lot easier. Thicker, it would be heavier. drop set to normal push-ups. You can even throw in a couple explosives if you want. All right, moving on. All right, so the last exercise that I'm gonna show you that uses resistance for the bands, we have resistance band flies. All right, let's go for it. So we're going to bring our arm across our body and up. Make sure that you cross your upper chest, your upper pec and bring it back down. Control. Here we go. Very similar to a cable fly guys. All right, now let's move it on into assistance part of the workout. I'm gonna show you how to use these bands for assistance. So the first exercise for assistance is gonna be lean planche push-ups. Let's go. All right, so we're gonna put it over, put one side through, and let's start. So this is an assistance move. We're gonna put our foot through. So now it's doing the opposite. Instead of giving us more force, it's actually helping us lift our body up. So normally, maybe a lot of people can't do this move uh, without this thing, but applying this thing onto it is gonna give that little extra pounds leverage of a lift off your body. It's gonna help a lot. Now I'm using the lightest one, the red one. So of course, anybody can really realistically do this move. It just depends how, how heavy, how thick the band is. All right, so let's go for it. This is hard for you guys. Use a thicker band. Try the black one, try the green one. Try a thicker one. You should be able to do this. So we're gonna move on to the second exercise of the assistance training. We have impossible dips. Let me show you why they're called impossible dips. All right, so to do this move, you're basically coming up from this position right here and coming straight up. 
and you cannot move your body forward. You cannot jerk your body. Just literally from your arm, moving straight up just like that, okay? It really takes a lot of chest and a lot of tricep. All right, so this is how we're gonna train to eventually get this movement. You put your resistance band over the bar just like this. From this position right here, we're gonna come up, put our legs over, and sit down. From this position, we're gonna push, come right back up. So from this position, lean back and lower your body. You don't want your shoulder to pass your hands. Same thing when you come back up. Don't let your shoulders pass your hands. Lean back on this move. Same thing, lean back and come up. So this is a tough move. If you can only do a couple reps, don't worry about it. You'll get the hang of it. All right, moving on to the last move. I'm gonna need some chalk. All right, so the last move, we have one arm straight bar dips. But that's the last exercise of this workout. If you enjoyed the video, like, comment, share, and of course subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. And for more workouts just like this, in fact, complete programs to getting you into the best shape of your life, not just looking strong, but actually being strong, sign up right now to fenx.com. Get full access to all our workout programs, all our technique guides, daily workouts, and a whole lot more. Download our Thenx app in the App Store to take our workout programs with you everywhere. And if you guys need a little extra push during your workouts, of course, check out Thenx Ignite. It's our pre-workout that's gonna have you flying through your workouts. You can pick it up right now at thenx.com slash shop. Along with all our other stuff in our shop, like the Thenx joggers that are just restocked, our shirts that are just restocked, wrist wraps, weight belts, and a whole lot more that's gonna take your training to the next level. Remember guys, every Sunday, 8 p.m. USA, Eastern time is when we upload our videos. The first person to like and comment the video always is gonna win some Thenx gear. So always make sure you're the first person here so you can like and comment the video. And don't worry if you don't win this time because we do this every Sunday. One last reminder guys, we're so close to a million subscribers, we're gonna be hitting it soon. And when we do, I'm gonna upload my first video on the Chris Heria YouTube channel. You can actually go and subscribe to my brand new Chris Heria YouTube channel right now by going onto the Thenx YouTube homepage, looking on the right side of the related channels and you'll see the Chris Heria personal channel right there. Click subscribe and you're gonna be the first one to see when my video uploads. And if you're the first person to like and comment that video, you're also gonna receive some free Chris Heria gear that I have prepared for you guys. See you guys next Sunday. Love you guys so much. Peace out.